G'day Legends of the Internet, Struthy here. How the bloody hell are you and hope you're doing very well. We've had another suggestion. This one come through from AKM91. He said, Revenge the Fate, who I haven't checked out since November last year, with uh, the track Symphony Terakia. Looks like the track's actually called Symphony Menenju Akia, and that translates to Symphony to the End. So, yeah, another heavy track from the lads, I'm sure. So, this track's been around since... Uh, Oh, well, they dropped it on January 1st, 2016, so, yeah, a little bit five years old. Okay, let's do this. Uh, let's give this the old three, two, one... They had some strange time signatures, I remember, so, yeah. <laughs> oh! Gonna put some bands in some top five, top ten tiers of being, uh, you know, similar fans of another band. Definitely the Sugar fans out there. So I don't want to compare them. This is a little bit more of a. I don't know. It's a little bit more metal in there. <laughs> experimentation they do. It's like these lads pride themselves on having these really busy songs. It's great. It's just... First time listening, it's a lot to absorb. Not too sure about the second vocalist though. Takes me out of the song. How many guitar techniques? Just in that last section. Well, that's a wake up on my Sunday morning. <laughs> and Speaking of, happy Mother's Day out there to all the wonderful mothers of the world. Um, yes, uh, wow, okay, Revenge the Fate there with a uh, Symphony Manunju Akia, Symphony to the End. Um, yeah, that was pretty brutal, that was pretty heavy. Um, <laughs> I'm trying to go back to, to think about the other tracks that I, I checked out of theirs. Um, uh, what did I check out of theirs? Was it? Oh, yeah, I checked out their Dark Era track and I checked out Pembalasum. 
So, um, yeah, like I said, not, haven't listened to them since November, so it's been a long time coming, so good stuff. Yeah, I appreciate that, AKM91, uh, for the suggestion, and, um, yeah, keep on bringing them through. And, uh, I've got heaps of other bands coming through now, I've just got to get them all lined up and everything, sorry, I just had a little bit of a lazy weekend over here, but yeah. Anyway, you absolutely rock, appreciate your time, and, uh, yeah, please suggest other bands uh, along the lines of Revenge the Fate, who are mucking around, making my ears have to go back and definitely have a little, another listen. That track was only under the three minute, uh, yeah, three and a half minute mark sort of thing, so you can listen to that a few times, but yeah, the amount of, you see, it's script, uh, pick scraping and all that sort of stuff, and the little, just little pings and everything, and the, <laughs> just towards the end of the track, it was just getting like, oh dear lord, there's just so much to listen to. But um, yeah, guitar fans love that sort of stuff, and that's what these bands, you know, enjoy doing. It's a technical aspect, and it's fun. It's um, it shows that they've, you know, seasoned veterans at playing their own music and being able to nail that uh, in a live setting too. I'm sure. So yeah, just bringing the chunk, very very heavy. So, alrighty. Enjoy the rest of your day, of course, and once again, happy Mother's Day to everybody out there who gets to um, the opportunity to wish their mother a happy birthday, or, yeah, I hope you got some good memories or something to go back on. Alrighty. Peace out. Laters.